everyone welcome back to my channel so i've now come back from my um trip to new jersey and um in my last video i showed you what i'm gonna take with me for um journeying so i thought i'd share with you how i got to all you know, when you're limited with your supplies it's really interesting to just kind of like work what would you what you've got um the my sprocket has been really handy um, having it with me however I think it is quite ex it will be quite expensive if you're um, like me printing loads of pictures or um, yeah got loads of things that you want to put in your journey when I got back I printed out from my Canon selfie because I think it's just really uneconomical to um, carry on using my HP when I'm already back. The picture quality, as you know, isn't very good, but you can always tweak the pictures before you print it out. I did use a bit of my Alpha stickers, so I have enjoyed that. So you can see that there are stuff that are missing in it now. I've included this one sheet of paper from my lollipop lollipop box club and I've I've used every single um almost all of the stickers in it that as was really really good um I did tell you um I did say I'm gonna um use the vintage girl deco stickers from hazy days UK and that this sheet so I've used most of that sheet and two of that so that's really good and then I had some washi tapes with me, limited amount of washi tape. Um, I can say that I've used most of most of them. And so is the stickers and this little sticky um, notes, camera sticky notes. I've used that as well. I'm going to go back into my little um, journal and see if I can use more of this. I've used this, this group rather than that group. Um, because I think some of it are just like Japanese -y to me. I've, used, I've not used this much um, because I, I think, yeah, I've only used one of the stickers in here and some of the alpha sticker here. Um, I've used this. Uh, this is my um, DIY um, Peerless um, watercolor. I'm going to go through again because I've uh, made some leeway for me to be able to paint some bits and pieces. Um, yeah, and I've used most of the crafty, I found these crafty bonbons, um, travel theme, ephemera or die cut from my stash. So I took that with me, um, project life cards or the journal cards that was on my, um, travel theme crafty bonbons box. The other stuff that I really liked, um, using is this, my little trusty little scissors here. It's been really good. Uh, most of the stuff that I've put in there if you can see it I have used um, so as you can see my little um, travelers notebook um, has um, gone very chunky and I really loved journaling I, I think I think I'm gonna do it every single time we go on a trip just to kind of like um, document our journey or adventures so I'm not gonna go through page by page with you because otherwise we'll be here forever but um, I've decorated the front and I've stamped I made a boo-boo but I've covered it up we mainly stayed in New Jersey but we went um, everywhere else uh, well we went to Maryland and um, New York and Washington and Delaware so so I've just recorded um, things that yeah so I've saved up my our um, boarding passes just a bit of it and that's our, this is our first day or first night um, we were looking overlooking Manhattan um, slash New York City at night where we had some Japanese food um, this is just see I've used my watercolor here um, just um, just the silhouette of sky sky skyscrapers um and new york skyscrapers um and just colored it in um rainbow colors and documented our boat trip or um ferry trip around hudson river um this is my attempt 
of the stat silhouette of a Statue of Liberty, but we did that was amazing. Um, we it was a beautiful day and clear skies, so we were really really lucky and just really documented around where we've been in um, New York. We've been to Times Square. Um, we went to the strawberry fields in um, Central Park, which is a where there's a um, memorial for John Lennon. So I need to kind of write what this is. And just a bit of Central Park, Guggenheim Museum and the Met Museum. Um, I've put the Central Park map in here in a little envelope when I got back. And then we went on a tour bus, taking the uptown tour and where it's got, where I should be going and the receipt. Um, need to glue that down. Um, so yeah, this is our looking, uh, this is my attempt to document where we are. This is the back view where we stayed in Delaware at my auntie's um, house. It's beautiful. There's a lake in her backyard overlooking other houses, which is really nice. And this is, we had Chinese food at some point and my husband got it with my uncle. And um, there's like it says poo poo platter there, it's number 10. So he said on Facebook, surely number 10 should have been a number two, which is really um, funny. Um, had lots, lots of crabs, so <laughs> holy crabs. Um, that's um, that's the specialty for Maryland. Went to Maryland in Ocean City, um, went on the beach. That was that's what I said, best day ever. So yeah, so just documented um, all throughout my attempt to paint clams. <laughs> um, it's good fun, really. I think, uh, you know, I I just I just really loved every single moment of it that we were there. Um, this sticker I've added later on because we had breakfast and I found this sticker um, to eggs because we had breakfast at Bethany Diner at some point. Um, and this is a jazz night at a place called Culture, Cultured Pearl in Reho Booth in Delaware. That was really fun night. I really enjoyed that night. And then the next day, just documenting going to Annapolis. And we went to see the visitor center, which is amazing. It was really cute and quaint, that town. It's a harbor side um, town as well, like here in Bristol. And I got this from the Annapolis tourist um, leaflet. So it's just a history of how Annapolis um, formed. And this is a visitor's pass that we that we got, you know, we got given when we visited the state house or the, is it the state house? Yeah, I think it's the state house. Yes. So just a few bits and pieces of pictures over there. Um, food I had in Annapolis oh my god that's the most amazing crab cakes I've ever had so I had to document uh, document that also we went to the United States Naval Academy Academy but we weren't um, allowed to go in because we didn't have our passports then we went to Washington and we were in a market um, like a food marketplace called um, I can't remember, Union Market and there's a, a a shop called Pudin, which um, sells, as it says, divine comfort food, and I had shrimp and grit, and I had gumbo as well. And this is when we went to Washington. It was a rainy day, so we weren't able to go as much places as we wanted to, but, you know, we made the most of it. We went to the, and then I've just talked the, um, oh, I need to tape that. I just talked the um, map of the city there. There we go. And then we went back to New York. Um, so that was great fun because we took the subway, we went to the New York library, so and we took the bus going to the city because we we're only half an hour away by bus from where we we're staying. And then so I put the um, central library um, kind of like leaflet over there. I had to fold it in a way that it will accommodate it in this book. Yeah, went to Grand Central, saw the Chrysler building. 
uh, went to the 9-11 memorial and um, the World Trade, the new World Trade Center now. Um, yeah, that was really, really good. And I've included some um, coats for the 9-11. That was really, really emotional. Not emotional, but really, really sad. I'm just going to flick through. Oh, we went to Atlantic City as well. I'm just going to flick through my um, journal. I'm still yet to add some um, bits and pieces of writing in there. And I've included things like things I learned about Atlantic City. So yeah, I've yet to ha add some more um, journaling there. And then when we, we went back home at half past six in the morning and there was a beautiful, beautiful um, sunrise that I've witnessed from the car. So I thought I'd paint that too. This is a, um, I think this is 10 cents or five cents. But Auntie picked up to me, so she said, so that I get lucky. That's really sweet of her. So yeah, I just included some little bits and pieces there. Went to the vet high, mi high mile. And then we went to the UN headquarters in New York. Um, that's where my auntie and uncle used to work. They're now retired. And then I just added lots of additional stuff because obviously I wasn't able to include um, all, everything in one go. And I, you know, I had to kind of like print some of the photographs later on. So I, we went to Rockefeller Center, but we didn't go up because it, there was lots of people. Um, had to paint this we went to the Nintendo and I put Nintendo there Nintendo headquarters or a Nintendo shop in Rockefeller and that was amazing because it showed like um, Nintendo through time from the very first Game Boy that they, or game and game console they have which is the Game and Watch and I remember having that as a child to the very present game console they have and they've got something like the Game Boy that was um, found in the Gulf and it survived it's still working and then this was my was last nine o'clock so I was about to document here on my what what my last day was and then we had Chinese and I kept what my fortune cookie said I had two so it they both you know what they both um, had something to do with adventure and journeys or adventures really so that was really fitting um, so it's finally home time and we had our hot dogs and just documented our journey home. Just put the New York City um, map in here. And then because I didn't really finish everything and I've got this um, last um, signature in my book, I just um, wrote... Um, just to remind myself what I packed for travel journey, what I packed in this bag, um, places I've been to, things I bought, um, documented our, our poppy, how she was when we got back, and I've just inserted or just glued this um, journal. I don't know whether I'm gonna write some more. I think I, I, I feel that I need to write some more and just to kind of like reflect on the trip, um, but I'll do that at a later date. But um, overall, I enjoyed taking my little pack with me and journaling our um, adventures on our trip. So I hope you enjoyed seeing what um, I've done with my um, journal, my mini journal. And please don't forget to subscribe and, and like if you like what I've shared with you today. And hope to see you again sometime soon. Um, thanks for watching and I hope you're all having a great day. Bye for now.